I will cause your message to reach all the corners of the world. And today we see the fulfillment of that great prophecy that there is nowhere on the surface of this earth that Jamaat Ahmadiyya hasn't touched. I assure you that one day we will see the reigns of Jamaat Ahmadiyya all over the world and the opposition that people are actually harboring against us. That will also become a turn of the past. Long live Ahmadiyyat, long live Islam. The Holy Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, Naibiyu Kasardar, and Hazrat Mirza Ghulam Ahmad Qadiani alayhi salam, Zindabad. One day this Jalsa will be the greatest thing on the surface of this earth. May Allah bless you. This is my many, uh, 16th, many times I come to Jalsa Salana UK. Alhamdulillah, all the speeches of to date, from yesterday and today, this morning, of Hadrat Khalifa Tulmisi al Khamis, Adi Allah Talmud al Aziz, is faith inspiring, and all the other speeches. But Alhamdulillah, the atmosphere of the Jalsa is just electrical, it's just amazing, and it's just a joy to be here. So the preaching of Ahmadiyya Muslim Jamaat, the love for all, hatred for none, which was established by the third Khalifa, Hazrat Nasruddin Ahmad, uh, it is a well understood and a peaceful message to the whole world. In, and, that is the and that is what we are carrying out in our own country over there. We speak with one voice and we stick with the, uh, with, with, with the commandment of the Khalifa. And that is why we are different from other Muslims. They do not have the Khalifa, they do not have leader, and we have a leader. And our leader, when he speaks, we follow throughout the country. And that is a blessing for us. The arrangement is fantastic. In fact, it's wonderful how the organizers are able to cope with the magnitude of visitors. We are all well accommodated. We have good treatment, good accommodation, good facilities. But that's one thing my people complain about. <laughs> they say they eat rice morning and evening. As Africans, they would love to eat some other things apart from rice. But that's that, by the way. My duties these days is uh, in the Tablik department, so we meet the newcomers who come for seeing the Jelsa who haven't joined the community. So. It's always a great opportunity for, to show them around and uh, capture the atmosphere of Jelsa. And this is the beauty, I think, of Jelsa. It always has been. The speeches is very, very important, praying behind Azur and meeting the people, and that makes the atmosphere great. We always look forward to it. It's the highlight of the year. So it's always a pleasure to come to Jelsa and enjoy. And, uh, when we do the army bayat, it's a very, very moving moment, you know, to repeat these words behind the Khalifa and to pray with him. And after that, uh, to do the sajda, I shukr. That's the biggest moment, I think, for our Jalsa, for UK Jalsa. And I don't think we, we, can, we, can, we can find it anywhere else, I think. But that's the biggest moment for us. Yeah. For me, it's very special this time because I receive a big surprise because I will make the place of Bayat in the hand of Hasur, representative of, the, of Americas, and this is a big blessing uh, for our countries, alhamdulillah. And uh, everybody who comes with us, sisters and brothers, are enjoying this uh, nice atmosphere of uh, the blessings of the Yalsa.